Not every day you see this at the lakefront. People hitting the water with their boards to take advantage of the, the wind and the waves. Brr, that's got to be cold. Meteorologist Mary Kay Gleis is here tracking more oh. strong winds over the weekend. Hmm. Oh, that water temperature, Brad, 50 degrees. So, yeah, that's a cold one, but the waves were huge. As we go through this evening, the waves will die down a bit on the Illinois side because the winds relax and temperatures will move into the mid-30s. We enjoyed so much sunshine today, but that did not help our temperature. 43, that was it for the high, and right now we are standing at 41, but we have dropped to 38 degrees in the loop. 39 right now as you head into northwest Indiana, around Whiting and Munster, 43 degrees as you head out to the western suburbs near Plainfield and into LaGrange. Well, high pressure is in control, and as that high is overhead, the air is sinking and drying. That's why the winds are allowed to relax. But that high is on the way out tonight. We'll keep it clear tonight. Go to 32 degrees, but tomorrow those winds start to pick up after lunch. They will be warm winds, though, out of the south, and that's for your Halloween day, taking temperatures into the 50s as those winds get pretty gusty around town. But I am tracking a cold front. Look at the temperature change. 57 tomorrow and 39 only on Sunday. It's all because of the wind direction around that front. What we see is the winds picking up on Saturday, especially into the evening, getting very gusty, coming out of the south and southwest. Then around midnight, that front starts crossing the area, and you see this intrusion of northwesterly winds. That pulls in that incredibly cold, blustery air for the afternoon hours on Sunday. That's why I'm only going with the 30s. And when you go to bed Halloween night, don't forget to fall back. So sunrise, sunrise. Sunday is 623 and the sun sets at 443 in the afternoon. So for that Bears game Sunday afternoon, 39 for the high, mm -mm, it's going to feel like 25 degrees. So a cold's closed to the weekend, but we are expecting to have a beautiful trend of weather next week, all kinds of sunshine, and we are putting together a few days in the 60s.